we shall now learn link with ORM designer. In the last series we learnt link with database manually. But as we pointed out that manually doing will not uh, be very productive because it will require a lot of manual effort on your part. Especially when foreign key or primary key relationships have also to be added. So from now onwards we shall be using the ORM designer approach because it allows us to be more productive, do our projects quicker and is the recommended way of doing things. Let us try it, uh, before doing anything, before proceeding anything, let us first of all create two tables that we will require throughout and use the designer. Then we will talk about the theory and all. First of all let us go for the practical story. So to start with, uh, you should follow me in this lecture and this is the table that you should draw, TBL doctors. Create a database with SQL server. We have used full SQL server for this. So add it to app underscore data. Right click there, add to app underscore data full SQL server and then create this table called TBL doctors. And these are the four columns in this. The first column is email and it is primary key. Name, phone is regular is a bit. Default value is set 0. These four brackets will automatically come, you simply type 0. Or you can have a look at the SQL query. This is also possible but this is self-explanatory. Then I will show you where it is exactly. It is under app underscore data. We right clicked here. We right clicked here. Add new item. Then we picked up SQL Server Database. Give it any name. Preferably start it with DB. You should start it with DB so that it is easy to recognize in code later on. And then we went to Database Explorer. You will find this table is empty. You can use add new table and don't forget to rename the table here. The table name is specified at this point. Table name is specified here. By default it will be table. You should erase this and type your own name. Similarly, we added the second table called TBL patients. You can see the design of this table. ID is an int and it is identity type. How to give identity type I will tell you in a moment. Patient name and Dr. FK are the other two keys here. How to give it auto number right click properties and click on properties if it vanishes pin it and here uh, set this is identity to true. By default it is false. After you have added this table called TBL patients, we have two tables now, TBL patients and TBL doctors. Let us add some data. So first of all we will add data to TBL doctors. We have added three records D1, D2, D3, N1, P1. Since this D1, D2, D3 will be a foreign key there. We again go to our database. In TBL patients, we added some patients and we ensured that Dr. FK is one of those D1 to D3. So that the relationships are maintained correctly. So uh, this will settle your database.